Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the news in English on RTVC. First, the main points. Reorganization of the church in Beberati to conform to the goal of phase three in terms of house churches. 15 new books of ZTF to be produced by the editorial secretariat. Those were the headlines, now the news in full. The Adamawa Spiritual Province has had its third prayer siege in Gaundown. The siege was organized by the provincial leader, Pastor Robert Anongigume, and was held from the 28th to the 31st of May 2020. 17 churches were represented by close to 90 pastors and leaders from the localities. Prisca Domato once more. Praise. Worship and thanksgiving were the activities that marked the first part of the third prayer siege of the Adamawa spiritual province. One of the participants, Pastor Chofo Zhang, shared on the importance of celebrating one's date of conversion. While Sister Estambui exalted the brethren to be patient with unbelievers, just as God has been patient with us. In conclusion, Pastor Robert Anon called upon those present at the siege to believe the prophecies God has given to our community. He also pointed out the need to raise prayers for the leaders. Other activities of the prayer siege included terminating with the past and brotherly fellowship. For RTVC, I'm Domato Prisca. A siege to raise a certain volume of prayer for Pastor Theodore Andosi has recently taken place here at the headquarters. The prayer siege was organized and led by Sister Adela Andosi from the 19th to the 20th of June 2020. Details with Sandrine Dasi. It all took off effectively in 2017 with a burdening Sister Adela had to ensure that Brother Theodore Andosi succeed in fulfilling the vision that the Lord gave our beloved brother Zach. Realizing that she could not raise all the volume of prayer necessary to carry out this task, she raised co-workers not only at the base of the work but also in the localities. They started with prayer nights from midnight to 6 a.m. in 2017 and then went up to 6 p.m. in 2018. Then, with the experience gained from the prayer sieges held by Sister Esther Kona, Sister Adela has set up monthly prayer sieges of 24 hours for the leader while maintaining the rhythm of the 16-hour prayer siege per week. As earlier mentioned, the team she has raised in Menganga and Ayos also carry out monthly prayer sieges of 24 hours each and sent her a report. The editorial secretariat has been meeting since the 18th of June 2020 with the goal of producing 15 new books by Professor Zakaria Stani Formum. The retreat is taking place at the exhibition center here in the headquarters. Details with Sandra Molola. Eternal rank, prevailing in prayer through importunity, talents and spiritual gifts. These are some of the titles the editorial secretariat has been working on since the 18th of June 2020. The goal is to produce 15 new books by Professor Zakaria Stane Fomum. The production process consists of converting cassettes containing Brother Zach's teachings into digital files and then transcribing them into English. The Jitora Secretarial team is made up of co-workers from Buya, Bamenda, Duala and Fumban. That was a package for you today on the news on RTVC. The news will be back next week, same time, same frequency. Till then, have a blessed week. Bye-bye.